What's up guys and welcome back to the channel. Today we got some new toys to talk about for my Tesla Model Y long range. All the accessories, all the modifications are from the Hollow Black. Yet again, no surprise to the channel, but let's not waste any more time. Let's hop in the whip and go over all these things. Not to waste any time. I'm gonna jump right into, I will say the sleeper of the bunch, no pun intended but it's a headrest for the Tesla Model 3 and Tesla Model Y. So the one thing about Tesla seats, I know primarily for the Model 3, Model Y, the way that they're shaped, they're kind of shaped like a, kind of like a V in some sort, where the back is straight and then the headrest kind of leans in, leaning, leaving like a little gap right here between your neck and your back. So it's not like it's super uncomfortable or anything like that, but on long trips, it does become a little annoying. And this is where this comes in. So I actually took it on a road trip over Thanksgiving break, uh, drove 800 miles uh, throughout California that weekend. And this thing, honestly, when I call it the sleeper, this is the first time I've ever actually slept in my Tesla, like ever. Um, so I took it to a supercharger. We had a long uh, stretch to go as far as charging wise. And this thing actually knocked me out. This thing is premium quality, super, super, super soft. The one thing I do like, it has different latches on here. So you can pick where exactly you want your height to be. And it's very elastic. So it stretches, uh, very mobile to go around the seat. And like I said, it's very, very soft, like extremely soft. Feels really, really nice. Um, I don't know what type of materials inside, but it feels very, very soft. And even just on the exterior, very, very soft to the touch. Um, and they, they sent over two. So I have one for the driver's seat, then I have one over for the passenger seat. Um, this thing is premium. I absolutely love it, especially if you drive a lot, if you do a lot of road trips. This has to be added to your arsenal, added to your Model 3, Model Y. Uh, link is down in the description below. Up next, we have the coin holder from Hello Black. This thing is pretty cool. I mean, I'm not one to carry a bunch of change, uh, but for whatever reason, I had a bunch of pennies in <laughs> my center console. So shout out to Hello Black for sending this over to help me manage over all those loose pennies I had for whatever reason, I don't know. Um, but if you're a person that has a ton of change and you just like throwing it down in that center console or in your armrest. Now you have a nice, cool, sleek, organized way of uh, managing it. I just keep it right here in my armrest, um, out of sight, out of mind. But um, yeah, it's cool it's for, for your change. Quarters, nickels, dimes, pennies. And yeah, cool little contraption right there. Link in the description below. Up next, we have the Boring Hub from Hello Black. So this is a USB hub that goes right in the center console of your Tesla Model 3 or your Tesla Model Y. I've used a lot of USB hubs in the past. Some of them I've even showcased on this channel. Um, they all do the same thing. You know, they're USB hubs. Some of them have lights and they charge things. Cool. The thing I love about Halo Black is I always say they always have really cool designs and they're functional. Everything has a use case. So on top here, they have a button which has the capability of activating RGB LED strips on the side, which I think is super cool. Just adds a little touch, a little a little flare to the USB hub. Um, it has two USB A ports and then also a USB C port. Now, the thing that I love about it is most USB hubs, they use two USB-C prongs that use both of your USB-C ports down in your in your deep console area where you can't use anything else. So this one only uses one and it gives you three ports on top. So I think that's awesome. Also, they have these little slits on top, which if you don't really think about it, it's like, well, well what is it? And like I said, they only use one port. So now you actually have an additional port down there and you can actually funnel here. I'll show you. You can actually funnel up cables from. So let's say you have a, a cable down in the bottom. You can funnel it through. So now you don't have to keep you see that it funnels right through. So now you can plug the other end straight into that other port and you don't have to keep opening and closing that door, trying to get the cable to pull it out. And now the cable is just in between the, the hub and the door of the center console or leaving the door all the way open. You, this is a cool, sleek, elegant way of just funneling it through. It looks like it's all OEM and it's 
it's very intentional and I love that. The other thing that they have on this hub is a button that illuminates light into the center console as well. Um, we all know it gets pretty dark in there and they added lights right inside of that and I think that is awesome. Honestly, this is probably the hub that I'm gonna be rocking with from here on out. I already took the other hub out. This is what I've been rocking with since around Thanksgiving and I absolutely love it. Um, the entire design is mostly plastic, but where the logo is right there, that's nice hard. Uh, I don't wanna say it's stainless steel, but it's definitely some type of metal. It looks great. The link is in the description below for that. And yeah, grab one of these. This is, uh, this is awesome. This is the boring hub. If you guys are enjoying that content so far, make sure you guys like this video and subscribe. I see a lot of you actually aren't subscribed to the channel, but it helps a lot if you guys subscribe. I can bring more content to you guys. So make sure you guys like this video and subscribe to the channel. Let's get back into it. And last but certainly not least is the dashboard storage tray. Uh, this thing is awesome. I honestly did not think anything of this. I've seen other manufacturers make their version of this. And honestly, it's never been something I wanted, never thought I needed. It just never really appealed to me. But when Halo Black sent this over, I was like, you know what, let me give it a shot. Let me give it a try. And I absolutely love this. One, here's the big thing. It's not plastic. The whole thing is a food grade silicone that they actually took the time to cut and actually match the trim of the OEM dashboard inside of your Tesla Model 3 or your Tesla Model Y. So the actual cut, it sits flush with all the little minute and intricate cuts of the dashboard and it sits seamlessly right up against your center console screen. Now, my issue with this it's not really an issue it's something i thought would be an issue but it's not i have a modified tesla screen so my screen goes left and right up and down the way that this is demonstrated is that it's supposed to sit flush right up against the dash and the screen but my screen is actually lower and it actually moves this actually still does work with this product like i honestly didn't think that it was going to work because my screen is not actually placed in the same uh, angle or the same the same height. It's actually it's modified. So if you guys out there have modified Tesla screens, this product will work with that. So no worries there. Um, and I think that's awesome that this still works with the way I want to modify my Tesla. So a few other things that this thing has is they have these little magnets here which have their logos on them, which again, they don't always have to go this hard, but they do. I'll probably never see these magnets because it's always gonna be behind the screen. But actually what the magnets are meant for is they have like these little, these little parts right here. So let's say you wanna put some documents up there or something that's gonna move. Uh, you can just clamp that down with a magnet. I've even seen people use this tray to put their sunglasses, their keys, their wallet, uh, a box of tissues, um, just stuff that's out of the way, but it's something that's easy to grab. Um, so I think this is a great product, a great find. And again, I think my biggest thing is that it's not plastic. I hate hearing like small crinkly and like knocking sounds when I drive. So knowing that this is full silicone, it's not gonna make any noise, it's not gonna move. I absolutely love this. So link is down in the description below for this. And that's all I got for you guys today. I gotta send another huge shout out to Halo Black. They always support the channel. One thing that I love about them is that they're always innovating and they continue to innovate in even the new vehicles. One thing they wanted me to let you guys know is that they have accessories coming for the Project Highland Tesla Model 3. So if you guys are going to be taking delivery of the Tesla Model 3 Project Highland version, uh, Halo Black has you guys covered. So accessories coming for that model soon. And they also have some other accessories coming out that I'm not going to talk about in this video, but I've seen pictures of it. They've sent me videos of the manufacturing and yeah, it looks kind of crazy. So make sure you guys stay tuned to the channel to get updated on that. And as far as all the products that we talked about in today's video, all of the links are down in the description below. And don't forget to use the code Tessie Vibes. Uh, it helps the channel out, helps me bring out more content for you guys, and also saves you guys a little bit of cash over at checkout. So if you guys enjoyed this video today, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, and we will catch you on the next one.